So I had to first get a critical mass of people who would go out every day, which is not easy, and make a living depending on what they do. You see, when you're an entrepreneur, nobody will give you a paycheck. You have to create your own paycheck. And not, not too many people can do that. Do you understand that being an entrepreneur is a special breed of people? You know what I'm saying? Entrepreneurs have this thing that I don't mind being at risk of paying my rent or my car note because I see something greater, you see? And so, you know, so we've been able to um, create these entrepreneurs. They'll be in town, you know, this weekend because we have a sales meeting and it's going on. But again, when I when they come and, and I go before them and I see people who've been out here working and, and they got family involved and, and they got friends involved and, and they're excited about what they're doing, that's a turn on for me because I know that we've been able to create with this model other businesses as well. Any A lot of people are focusing on their children, like never having a relaxer in life. I'm one of those people. Um, and really focusing on the ingredients. So have you guys thought about what you have, but do you have plans for a children's line? Because DE still has that kind of air of, I'm not using that on my four-year-old type thing, especially at the price point. So I'm wondering, have you guys, you know, looked into that or have plans for a kid's line? As a, as a natural progression of the brand, there are definitely other segments that we look at. Kids, people have asked us about kids, they've asked us about baby before. And so we would take, we would go in and kind of do our analysis and make a determination as if that is the best path uh, to choose. Um, but the kids market, you know, is a little bit smaller market. Because um, especially in today's market, we get into some of the natural products, some of the natural products, especially um, a little more kid friendly. So we have to determine is if that is the most valuable market for us. And right now, as we put together our brand strategy, it's not like in the immediate future to go um, on the kid side. It is something that we've looked at and we've evaluated, but it's not a, at the top of the list at this time. Okay, this might be our last question here. Hi, my name is Dee Winfrey, and I'm with Pretty Girl Rock Dresses and Pretty on That Thing. And I really don't have a question, I have more of a statement. My stylist uh, started using design essentials for my hair when I was 12 years old, and I have, I'm 35 now, and I have always used design essentials. And I just want to say thank you, because nothing do my hair like design so, um, and I absolutely love the fact that you guys, you all are doing I was relaxed, and now I can still use design essentials on my natural hair. So I just wanted to say thank you. I would thank you. Thank you for that endorsement. I think we're running out of time, but I just wanted to um, ask if you guys have had any last statements or any closing remarks you'd like to say. Um, of course, first of all, my closing remarks are follow us on Instagram, uh, yeah, on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, please. Um, I'm really honored to be here and to to meet all of you and to have this um, opportunity and to just be blessed in that we've been here for 25 years. So. Thank you for coming out, for even wanting to spend this time talking to us. Um, I look forward to coming around, meeting many of you, getting some cards. I see a lot of opportunities in the room. Um, and come to our booth. We have a lot planned. Um, so we'll, we'll see you at our booth. And the booth is just for the audience. <laughs> Theater too. It's theater two at at Georgia World Congress Center. Ron Brothers. Ron Brothers International. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I would like to also just say thank you um, to everyone in the room that supported us over 25 years because I think it's allowed it's allowed me to graduate college in '98 on a Saturday, and um, <laughs> my father told me to be to work on Monday. Oh, wow. <laughs> and, uh, 
Sunday off. <laughs> but but it's, it's, it's because of the people in this room that's allowed me that opportunity to, to where it wasn't even a, a question of what I was going to do uh, after college. And so it's a thank you to everyone and hope you continue to support because uh, my son, who will be 11 next month, I plan on attending his graduation on a Saturday. And Don't give him Sunday off. Be to work on Monday. <laughs> great. That's Once again, yeah, I think, I think it's great that you all are here. And just first of all, just thank you. Thank you for coming out and taking the time to come and uh, hear, hear about us. Um, right now, I mean, the market, we're very excited about the market um, as a whole and, and what's going on. We're excited about the definition that has changed from activism to texture and what it means. And I think what it means as a, as a company and really driven by a lot of y'all out here is that uh, as you can really grow your brand uh, to be a truly powerful brand like a P&G. Why we can't be a P&G, a well, or something like that? Why we can't have those ambitions? Well, we do have those ambitions, and we have those ambitions because what's taking place and how the market has been redefined. And we're seeing a resurgence in African-American-owned companies. All these natural companies that we're talking about, they're all African-American-owned. The ones that are online, they're African-American-owned. Uh, we have a lot of hairstylists that are doing very well, especially with hair weaves and extensions. They're selling it online so we're seeing a complete in all of this activity we're seeing a complete resurgence in the number of african-american business owners is what we're actually seeing and so we think it's kind of great and we are excited about that we're excited uh, to be a part of that during this time and then i think we owe it to a lot of you all out here in the audience because of the communication the activity that you're drawing awareness that you're bringing uh, uh, to this industry. And so it's driven by all of you out here. And I just want to say thank you and say we greatly appreciate everything that you've done, not only for the company, but for the industry as a well. whole. Um, I just want to second what, what Cornell is saying. And um, as I said earlier, um, you know, that I passed the baton. But I think that my turn on is to see all of you guys you know, in business, prospering, doing the things that you're doing, running businesses, because we don't have enough of you. We don't have enough of us, not enough of us. But when I look out at this audience and I see all of you, and I and I hear somebody talk about where are the black people and where are the African Americans in terms of this business, and this is just reassuring um, to see you to, and for you to accept that now it's up to you to expand your businesses and to do well in this space and to be a good entrepreneur, a successful entrepreneur. And so, um, again, I'm excited because things have been passed to you and it is a different day. And, and the thing that you're doing is exactly what needs to be happening right now in terms of the way we market these products and how you participate in this process with all the new people coming along. And so to see this young, vibrant group of folks is a big turn on for me after being in the business, not 25 years, but 43 years. Mm -hmm. Okay? So thanks to you, and keep it up. Thank you so much, and now we're gonna take some photos. Okay. Okay, but just before we take photos, does anybody remember the Design Essentials advertising, either television or radio advertising? We still remember it? You all are too. You too young? Are young people in the room? Nobody remembers? You all remember the, the personality from the television and radio commercials? Oh, what was it? Okay, I have a special announcement for you. Special anniversary, that's right. I'm Andrew Diane, a healthy shark. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for coming Congratulations to Ms. Bryce on 25 years of black family entrepreneurship. And thank you for sharing this moment. We're going to do a couple things. We're going to do photo ops now with the family, and then we don't want you to leave because we have one more special treat that's planned for you. So we'll start with the photo ops, and then we're gonna come back with one more presentation, okay? Street to a meeting, but I think there's some food coming for me, so let's get ready to spread the buzz. Let me see if we can get a little logo in there. And happy 25th anniversary, Design Essentials. Spread the buzz. Here she buzz.
Go now to DryerBuzz.com and follow at DryerBuzz on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. It's all about the buzz.